everyone, it's Jamie Zebra 23. I'm doing your tarot card of the day for um, November 21st, 2017. So I just want to cover something. Okay, so it's been brought to my attention. Okay, so um, people are like, well, where's your ring? Why aren't you wearing your ring? So some embarrassing stuff. So every time I wear my ring, it gets caught in my hair. My hair almost gets ripped off. Um, I cut my face. I cut my cheek one time when I was talking, trying to get this out of my getting the hair out of my face it gets caught and wrapped in there um I sliced my finger open it just seems like every time I do a reading my ring hurts me so my fiance which doesn't do social media and he doesn't watch my videos but he was noticing that every time I would do a video I would take the ring off or I would come back inside with no ring on so he's like what do you, you want people to think you're single I'm not single I'm engaged I'm getting married next month so yeah so um yeah you know, I always get like creepy, you know, people sending me emails talking about how they want to be with me. Weird stuff. I'm sure everybody on YouTube gets the same kind of emails, but yeah. But I am not single. I've got my reasons. <laughs> yeah, I'm Murphy's Law all the way. <laughs> so we've got a lot going on for you guys for um for the 21st of uh, November 2017. So I've chosen like a lot of cards here. Got all these. I'm doing all these cards. Okay. So uh, let's start with the Jesus card. This is for November 21st, 2017. Okay. All right. You got knock and it shall be opened unto you. Matthew chapter 7, verse 7. I love these cards. So make sure that you guys are really asking for, for what you need so that your needs can be met. Try to be specific with what you ask for. Okay. Now let's do divine order from the Dorian Virtue Archangel deck. Where is it? Why are my Jesus cards in there? Okay, that's weird. Why are my Jesus cards in that box? Oh, um, that's the guy. Oh, here it is. The Archangel deck. <laughs> I, I know I look a mess. I had to run from inside to outside. The um, my, my, my fiance is running interference saying where I'm at. Oh, she's in the car, you know? She's looking for something. <laughs> oh, I feel like a bad 14 year old. Okay, divine order. Um, Archangel Raduel, everything is how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and see the underlying order. So you might be like, my life is a living hell. It's a complete and total nightmare. Nothing's going my way. Please, something's got to give. You're at a standstill for a reason. It's for a reason. Who knows? That's kind of like, you know, I've had several incidents. Sorry to go into what I'm going this was, I was pregnant with the one-year-old. So while I was pregnant with the one-year-old, I kept having trouble with my, with my X5 BMW. Um, so one day I tried to turn it on and it was like system failure, system failure, the, the, the thing that came up and I thought my car was broken down. So I had to call an Uber, which I did. And then as the Uber was pulling out, I just saw a five car pile up that, well, it was already, like it had already just happened. So if I would have pulled out, if my car would have been working and if I would have been pulled out, I would probably have been number six in that five car pileup. I would, I would have been the sixth car. And then um, as soon as I got home, I turned the car on because I was going to have to get a, a tow truck. My car was working just fine. So it's divine order. All of these things happen on purpose to propel us where we need to be or protect us from some fucked up shit. Come on, we've all been there where we're like, at, at the time we were like, I lost the love of my life. Oh God, I can't live. And then years later, you're like, thank God for getting me out of that situation. So it's all divine order. I'm saving the Rider weight cards for last because it's a doozy. Okay, so for the next, the, the, um, the Archangel or the Guidance, the Goddess Guidance Oracle Cards by Dorian Virtue. You've got Frisia. Unleash your adventurous side. Take risks and be daring. Some of you are stuck in your comfort zone. Get out of your comfort zone. If you want to make a move, if you want to get on a dating site, if you want to show your boobs or your you-know-what or your penis on a, you know, chit-chatting or sexting, go do it. Of course, with the permission of the other person. I'm not saying, you know, send a group message of your penis. Please don't do that. Don't do it. Okay, come on, guys. Please. All right, now let's go to the... <laughs> to the right away you got the page of pentacles you got the page of wands and you got the page of swords when i see all these cards i think gossip somebody's gossiping there's a lot of he said she said or somebody's juggling multiple people 
and that's what's going on. Some of you right now, you're having fun. Eh, you're talking to this one, you're talking to that one, because you don't know which one you like. It's like Goldilocks and the Three Bears. You're looking for just right. This one's too hot, this one's too cold. You're looking for just right. Um, so these are, this is pretty much everything except for water. But what I also get from this is that somebody, a third party, may be finding out that they are a third party, and that's where this Page of Swords comes in. Also, I'm gonna separate this. Some of you may be hearing from a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius, or you may find out that you have two stalkers. These two stalkers could be a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries, or there are three different people stalking you right now. I know for some of you, you're gonna be like, I've never had a stalker, I don't know, no, no. Well, congratulations, stalk, it's not good to have a stalker. So, so yeah, from somebody who's been stalked their whole life, uh, congratulations to you if you've never had a stalker. Congratulations, okay? It's not for you. But for those of you that are frequently getting stalked and you know what the hell's up and you already know, um, yeah, uh, keep that in mind. I feel like somebody may, may be using a fire sign or a fire sign may be using this one to try to stalk you. So ex expect um, Facebook weird Facebook messages, requests, uh, people asking you weird things that maybe they shouldn't know about. Just some nutty, crazy shit. So just keep that in mind that, you know, somebody's out there. Also, somebody could be spying at work. Somebody could be spying going through your emails. Somebody could be um, making sure that you're actually showing up to work on time, leaving on time. Somebody's trying to make sure that everything's like following suit the way it's supposed to be. All right, guys, that was your tarot card of the day for November 21st, 2017. If you'd like a personal reading, check out the description box. I no longer have a 15-minute reading. It's 20 minutes, 40 minutes, 60 minutes. Um, I do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I um, also have a new feature, same-day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I answer those questions within about 20 minutes or less. All right, guys, ta-ta for now.